This one was just emotionally overwhelming because I think it showed me some of the worst. There's this dog, this gunshot wound to his head, sitting right next to me, just looking at me, and I just lost it after takeoff. Certain things are just etched into your mind and you will never forget them. I remember them coming to the gate. She curled up next to me. I wrapped the blanket around her and she went to sleep so I could see that she was okay. To be able to provide that, you know, it's very rewarding in itself. It said like emergency 911. This girl was shot in the head and left to die. I saw her and I just had this like gut feeling. That's my dog. The guy brought her out of the truck and the second I saw her, I just like waterworked. I started falling instantly. Especially in the beginning, I would say, like, you're safe, you're loved, like, you never have to worry about that ever again. But now, we just enjoy life. What do you find, babe? I've taken her paddle boarding. She's hiked to the top of mountains. She loves the snow. She used to walk so slow, just, like, head down. And now she, like, prances around. It just makes me so proud of her and so happy for her. And then, obviously, the dogs had to be in the wedding. It was so cute. <laughs> I think she just saw like a hundred people and she's like, oh my gosh, like a hundred people are here to see me. She's just so pure. She's just like pure love. And it seems like everyone who meets her just kind of melts because they feel it right away. I don't think that a day goes by that I don't just like love on her so hard. It's just crazy to think what her life was before the incident and then what it is now, which is so happy, so spoiled. Even still, we have moments, Bill and I, where we look at each other and we're just like, look at how far she's come. She's kind of like exactly what we were looking for and we didn't even know it. Can you stay just for a minute longer? Hey guys, I'm Roman. I've got a really 